Okay, this is going to be a tutorial on how to set up a Feed the Beast Minecraft server using Evolve. Uh, first, you want to make sure that you have the most recent version of Java. Uh, I'll provide all the links below in the description. Okay, you're going to want to install the Evolve client. From here, I'll, I'll also include this in the description. You're just going to hit install at the top right. That'll bring you to the client page and hit install the Evolve client. Feel free to run that. Okay, now you're going to want to set up an account, but if you've already used Evolve before, feel free to log in. Now that we have this set up and logged in, at the top left of either of these tabs, you can hit Evolve and hit Create Party. I already have some parties created, so we'll just log into one here. Sure you install the device software if it's not already installed. Now this is where you're going to be able to invite your friends uh, if they have an Evolve account set up. Be sure to verify your email address so you can use all of the party tools essential. Now go back over to here, go to the legacy windows, hit download. After that's downloaded, you're going to want to run the application and it comes up with this client. Scroll up to the most recent mod packs, whichever one you desire. Uh, we're going to go with Infinity Lite. I already have a server set up, but from here you can hit download server. Legacy launcher is much easier to use this to set that up. Uh, you would have to search online for a little bit to find the actual server download if you were using the curse client. But since I already have that set up down here, what you'll get is a, a zip file. I've moved that over to my desktop here and then you'll extract all. I also have that folder set up already. We'll go ahead and open that. Go back to it. Now hit download now on feedthebeast.com. Hit install. It's going to install the entire curse client for you. I of course already have one. And now that you're on the home screen of the curse client, you're going to want to click on the left side of Minecraft. Now, after you log into your Mojang account here, you're going to have access to all the Feed the Beast or regular mod packs that curse has to offer. Go to browse Feed the Beast mod packs. Since we are using Infinity Lite here, you can hit install. I already have it installed. Uh, so I'm just going to go back to my Minecraft tab and hit play. It takes a little bit of time to start. But if everything up to now, if you've done correctly, it should be easy to connect to the server. Now let's go over to the Feed the Beast Infinity Light server folder that we just extracted onto the desktop. Make sure before you do anything else, you go to the EULA text document and you change what originally was false to true. Uh, this is just basically accepting the terms and conditions. Go to server start batch file and double click it to run it. As long as you have the most recent version of Java, you should have no trouble launching the server. Well, that's working. We also have the game loading up. Of course, these two take a while to launch. Uh, it's because it's loading so many mods. But after this is done, I'll come right back to it. I currently don't have a server added to this list yet, so we'll hit add server. And we can name it anything. Minecraft test. Go back to Evolve, right click on the leader's name, whether that be you or your friend setting up the server, copy their IP address, paste that in. Now it looks like we have the server running. Feel free to join the server. I can make sure that it's actually working. And now here on the server list, you can see that I joined the game. Now that we're loading in the game, you can have multiple friends join. If you have any more questions, feel free to leave them down below. Uh, I will try to answer as much as I can. I did hear some issues with Evolve and connecting to your friend's servers because you might have an IP not adjusted yet, but I'll be making a video on that in about two days. Thanks so much for watching, guys. Have a good one.